Andraste teaches that patience is the child of wisdom, but I'm eager to hear if you've seen the Shaper. Oh, praise the Maker! You truly walk in the light, friend. I already found a convert among the merchants who offered his shop as a temporary chantry. It's just by the tapsters. Please, come to our first service. Right. What do you want? Hey, I heard about you, Grey Warden, coming from the surface. Great crisis in the world. People are saying how you've thrown yourself on Harrowmont's wagon train. I figured you'd be the one, you know, who could help me find Branca. But I guess you're just like all the rest. Power-hungry deep lords. The only real concern they have is whose ass gets the throne. You don't have to play dumb, Warden. Their lackeys only come to me when they want something. Well, if you want the secrets of a paragon, do the work and find her. City's only living paragon, and she's been lost in the deep roads for two years. Two years, and no one's raised a bleeding army to go look for her. What's it matter to you, huh? huh. You trying to find out her secrets? That what Harrowmont sent you here for? I know he's been poking around, trying to find things out about her, what she was looking for. Won't tell me spit, though. He looking to take it for himself. A little lost technology of the ancients to throw Balin right out of the picture? You are looking for it. Of course, that's all anyone cares about. Well, sod off and sod your mother too. I need a bleeding drink. You keep on your errands. Until your boss really commits to looking, you're getting nothing but smoke out of old Ogren. Trosvala, champion. I hear your performance in the Proving was nothing short of amazing. I must thank you for bringing both Beisel and Widon back into the fight. His lordship was touched to see his old friends stand for him. There can no longer be any doubt where your sympathies lie. If you're ready, Lord Harrowmont will see you now. His lordship is looking forward to meeting you.
Welcome to Lord Harriman's estate. As you like. You must be under great strain with the blight upon the land. I will pray to the stone for you. His Lordship appreciates your support. I appreciate what you have done, Warden, and I apologize for putting one of your rank through such trials. I am Lord Pyral Harrowmont, and I thank you for your efforts to help me preserve King Endrin's throne. You may not know the story, but Balin is actually the youngest of three. Endrin's eldest, Trian, was murdered in the Deep Roads not a year ago. His middle son was found standing over the body and was exiled. But I've always found it suspicious that Balin knew just where to look. Endrin loved his sons too much to voice such suspicions. But he knew Balin's only interest in ruling was to further his own power. Balin resents me because I did not believe his setup. I wanted a full investigation, a trial, not this knee-jerk reaction. It speaks poorly of Balin that Endrin himself was the first to think that he should not be trusted. I have never sought the throne. My role was to serve Endrin first as his advisor, then as an elected desher in the assembly. A Harrowmont has never been king, and I always assumed Trian would rule after his father. But both Endrin and my colleagues have asked me to step up, and I will not back down when Orzammar needs me. The Assembly represents the voices of the wisest, most noble families. While we need a single king to preside over important functions and lead us in battle, the Assembly better represents all in Orzammar. For us, the Darkspawn are a constant menace, so a Blight may not elicit the same urgency you are used to. Ultimately, the Assembly decides what troops to send. If they no longer fear civil war, they'll have no reason to hold back. If you want my support to count, I will have to be King, and right now, there is no sure way to get there. Have you heard of a woman named Jarvia and the criminal Carter she runs?
The Assembly receives pleas every day from the common folk, begging that something be done about her. So far, no one has managed. Jarvia hides her base in Dust Town, the raw edges of the city where no one lives but castless and criminals. If you would help me in this, it would show the Assembly that I, and not Balin, have the ability to defend and rule this city. Do this, and I promise if I take the throne, I will not stop until the Assembly sends your troops. Look for Jarvia in Dust Town. Do whatever it takes to see that justice is served. about the halls of the Dwarven King, but the stories do it no justice. It is so strange, harsh, yet beautiful. And have you seen those tiny pig-like burrowing animals? They are adorable. I wish I could have one as a pet. But they must be hard to catch and... Oh, just ignore me. I'm so silly sometimes. Let's just go.
What are you looking for? We got nothing to buy for the likes of you. Or maybe you wanted to sell. Of course. back. You got more business for me? Well, our business is kind of covert, if you know what I mean. It's illegal in Orzammar for me to engage in protected trade, but they look the other way if I share things with my friends. For money. Enough to know she don't fancy strangers asking questions. Her base goes everywhere in Orzammar. You cross her or even talk bad, your bones end up in the lava. Could be if 30 silver came my way, I might know a bit. Fine. Only Jarvia's men knew all the entrances to her base. But I tell you, I've watched them. They go up to what look like bare walls, and poof! Gone! Like there's a secret door! There's one just across the way. Watch long enough, and you'll see. Now you owe me 30 silver. Pleasure doing business. Now you wanna buy something, or are we done? That's what I thought. What do you want, Warden? You're out of your element down here. <laughs> I'm no fool. Nobody just wanders around in Dust Town. You're here looking for me, and I don't like it. You've walked into a sodding fight, Warden, and I've already passed your stupid tome along. Too bad for you. Someone like you hanging about Dust Town so much. Nugs? Yes. They don't got much meat on them, but down here you can't be picky. Better than nothing. Nuggets. Lots of people sell them here in Dust Town. What for? You going to cook them up yourself? Yeah, I can find a nug for you. Could even get one from outside the city. Those ones in the deeps don't eat as much garbage. I don't know what they eat, but they always seem healthier, you know? Shiny coats, bright eyes. How much you giving me? Real silver, huh? I'll get you a big one for that. Give me some time. I'll hunt him down for you. You're back. I thought you weren't coming. What did he say? Both of us? I don't believe he said that. I've never heard him refer to my son as anything but trash. He calls him it. But maybe... Maybe Mother convinced him. Or you did. Oh, my friend. I cannot thank you enough. If this were a story, my son would grow to manhood and pledge himself as a knight in your service. When he grows up, I will send him to you. I promise.
didn't get enough of the architectural beauty of Dust Town? You need old Nadezda to play tour guide? Know it? I lived it, my friend. And let me tell you, it's worse now than in my day. Jarvia took over the Carta not more than a year ago, and already she's got every duster with both legs bearing swords for her. I'm not in the good anymore, and Jarvia's gotten real careful lately. Real paranoid. She's got Carta members all carrying these finger bone tokens. She scratches some mark into them so she'll know they came from her. There's doors to her base all over the city, but only one is ever open at a time. And if you show up without a token, you'd never know it was there. Can't help you there, Selraka. The Carta members keep them real tight. But that's worth something, right? Maybe just a little... I'll think of you when I go to bed with a full stomach. Well, look what we have here. Jarvia said you were looking for trouble. Congratulations. You found it. Fight like a bleeding archdemon. Sweet bloody stone, look at them all. The base is below the city. You, uh, you can get to it through the wall of the third house on this row. Put this token through the slot, and it'll open. Uh, will you let me go now? Uh, really? Oh, thank you. You're a good person. How do they say it? The ancestors have shown their favor. Bless you. <laughs> <laughs> 